tool. All right, guys, on the command, we're going to go four rounds into the heart. Four rounds. Set. Welcome back, everybody. That scene, those scenes, I should say, that you saw in the intro are from Pistolcraft One, taught out here uh, at Valor Ridge, which, as you can see, clearly is a beautiful place. And the uh, instructor was Mr. Reed Hendricks here. Um, for those of you guys that don't know who he is, uh, maybe he'll give a quick bio here in a second. But um, very. Uh, well thought out course of instruction is what he provides. Um, I was I actually watch his channel, and if you guys haven't uh, seen that yet, I'll put links in the video description. But um, one thing that made me want to come out here and, and train with him is uh, just his mannerisms and the way that what he presents is well thought out and logic and reason. Um, so that's something that certainly uh, speaks to me personally. So it's one thing I definitely like. But um, what what kind of stuff are you doing out here? What kind of classes are you offering? Stuff like that. For the viewers that don't know. Oh, okay. Well, what's up, everybody? My name's Reed. If you don't know who I am, we uh, um, we've been we've been wanting to meet and talk for a long time and, and collaborate on some things. So we finally got a chance, and and so we appreciate that. But um, well, we offer pistol, rifle, um, shotgun. We offer mid-range rifle, a designated marksman rifle, and we offer a small arms cards, which is pistol and rifle. So we have a nice. I mean, if anything minus belt feds, I guess is what you could say. So if you got a gun, chances are we can train you on it. Awesome. Um, yeah, what we've had out here has been great. We had a group, I think, of about eight or nine students out here today. Um, two different instructors giving everybody uh, individual feedback. And uh, even myself, definitely learning new techniques that I haven't seen and uh, trying the techniques that, that they teach here. Uh, one thing I think that's important is when you're a student is regardless of what you may think and what your habits may be to try what the instructors are presenting, um, even if it's something that's not your personal preference, uh, so you can learn maybe why they're telling you to do that or maybe pick up a new habit so we definitely did that today uh for sure so well that's good awesome. well i appreciate like um i mean the students that we had wide and varied experience very, very. <laughs> like we have some that had never taken a class before and we had some that hadn't even shot but maybe once or twice in their life and then you know we got other guys that have shot more than once or good twice <laughs> and maybe maybe a, a lot more than that and it was a wide and varied group so um the thing about firearms training is that it brings together people that normally probably wouldn't associate sure. with each other on a regular basis but in our class we had uh, so many different professions and people that were here that it was a, a interesting mix but nonetheless people still were able to, to do what needed to be done no doubt and one thing uh, I've noticed about this class that just brought it up that's different from some classes is it's not just a round expenditure class like it's not like bring 2,000 rounds you're gonna shoot all day each drill uh, every round down range has a purpose uh, focus obviously on accuracy because that's what counts. Uh, accuracy is final, um, so that's the most important thing. But all that stuff is uh, the basics are drilled into you, repeated, 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 and even someone like you said is a relatively new shooter can pick up on this stuff really quick. Yeah. Well, if guys are out there wondering, um, like, what's the atmosphere? I mean, you've had a lot of training, but what what's the class atmosphere like? Yep. Yeah, uh, that's uh, we talked about this offline, but um, it's it's very. Uh, it's not intimidating at all. No one's going to put someone down for making a mistake, not knowing something. Um, that's one thing I like. Uh, a lot of people like to think that, you know, they're like, because they possess this knowledge of firearms and how to use firearms, that they are somehow above people who don't. And uh, that's, there's none of that here at all. Um, it's just, you know, correcting the mistake, obviously, if there was one, and uh, moving on and, and continuing to practice the good habits. So um, definitely not, nobody's going to yell at anybody. No one's going to tell you you're dumb. Um, which I appreciate as well. So. Oh, well, I've found that I usually just tune that kind of stuff down, you know, I do too. and I just focus on what matters with the fundamentals. And hey, my goats escaped over there, guys. There's a bunch of, about a herd of about seven goats, and they are wreaking havoc on my blackberry patch over there. I did too. He <laughs> did too. But it's, uh, but I mean, it was a great day, and then we got a whole other one tomorrow. But, you know, we, um, we talked quite a bit well into the evening mm -hmm. over the campfire cut down a maple tree the environmentalists are like, but uh, <laughs> it's for firewood you weirdos but um but we had a good talk in the evening and i think um i think it's really important for people to get out there and and and, and even if you do have some training i mean i don't know anybody that's well trained that says i've got it figured out no and i most certainly don't have it 100 percent figured no, out I. but but there's no end game right and um man it's, it's just great to, to have you out here and and finally we did that we met at nra show we did and uh and i think that Man, it's just, it's really great that to see these guns and these people coming together and these people learning and doing it and encouraging one another. Yep. And, uh, 
We had we had we had a lot of, of positive energy today on the range. No doubt, for sure. But um, is that it? Good. Man, you whatever else awesome. you want to talk about. <laughs> I think that's gonna do it. So we don't bore you guys too much. But I want to thank Reed uh, for having me out and, and uh, let me go through the class. I do really appreciate it. Um, if you guys aren't familiar with it again there'll be a link down in the video description uh, with class schedules what kind of classes are offered all that stuff if you guys want to come out here as you can see again very beautiful scenery and the facilities here are awesome there's all different types of length engagements that you can be at uh, like steel targets paper targets berms everywhere it's it's gorgeous so thanks again for having me yeah. out i truly appreciate it thank you and uh hope to see you guys in the next video cool Start moving. Time, folks. We're gonna, uh, we're gonna draw the left hand only. This time, I want you to shoot the pistol empty, reload, and then one brain shot. Right. So shoot the pistol empty, reload, and then one of the brain. Left hand only. Take that right hand up high. Right hand up high on our chest. Keep it there. Your other right. There you go. You're your Navy your left. <laughs> it's a fork. Fork. All right. Here we go, folks. Here we go. Remember to shoot the pistol empty, reload, one of the brain. down okay and what I need to do guys is I need to come across hard just like that okay one two three replace the magazine make sense you hold that magazine with your butt I mean come down hard now what I'm hitting is my forearm against my thigh just like that okay really hard and that magazine will come right out and we still rack three times so I just need to get all that crap out make sense guys this will work probably a lot better for you okay all right all right, so this time on the command, you guys are going to draw your gun first, then assume a kneeling. I want you to, to take it, you know, alternated knee. If you did the right knee last time, let's, let's try the left. All right, folks, on the command, we're going to go four rounds into the heart. Attack. Look left, look right. I think Mike is sexy. 